opening the racket against flatter shots, blocking back into play and creating angles. Round deep into the backhand side, but here from the middle of the table, we can expect something different. What a with a more steady in the long rallies. Beautiful shot this backhand. Section time. Has a long way to go before she reaches her peak, her full potential. from taking game one, but the comeback artist has the serve. Ooh, hello? First, so creating a bit of an uphill battle. One. Look at Lost. this angle here. Five, three. One. Three, one. Three. A little bit late to get there. Tough ball, of course. Going corner to corner against a smaller player. The other receives at the backhand. Six. What can confident receive? Catching it right at its peak, right place, right time for Ito. Just for the record, and all four of them have been won by Kasumi Ishikawa. Mimi Ito has never won in their head to head. Seven. Out of the match to what appeared to be a wrist injury. Seven, ten. Three game points for Ito to take a two to zero lead. Ten. Beautiful forehand flip. Good combination. Quality opening. Two game points saved by Ishikawa. Oh. This receipt, straight side spin. Let's see if we get a good look at it. Maybe even a little bit of underspin from Ito. This is very unusual on a receive. Oh, top of the net break. Out of all the shots was saved, the last ball looked like something that Ito was quite capable to take. Yeah. Ishikawa, a service master, that higher toss serve right at the baseline. The banana through that receive. And Mima starting with the serve leading 2 to 0. 
Such a short. Shot is from Ishii. What the? Oh, yeah. those playing. What a shot! I mean, she's shown us with the backhand that she can be unstoppable. She's been so consistent this game. Look how confident and calm she is to go in style. What? On top of the table, right at the baseline. Two, five. There's that serve that I. Chole from the Ime Not quite as many Choles from the younger players. Not against Nito. Wow, table. Look at this way out there. Looked like it might have. And then right on top of the bounce, Ito's their fish. Perfect placement again. Multi ball rule. From Kasumi Ishikawa in the same head to head. A three to zero lead. Wow. Eleven to three. Ito on a roll right now. Games. More than double her opponent's score. Last one. One all. Ito's behind the table so much. One, two. Two, all. This is such a strong play. Low center of gravity, lower to the table. Playing the ball at its peak on the receiver. And the inside out forehand once at the deepest part of the corner. Four, two. Side spin coming around. Five, two. Pull off the table on her serve and then counter the opposite way. Service toss gets away. Interestingly, such a strong forehand flip from over the table. Pretty much every shot she's taken. Seven, four. On the top spin serve. Pen Five, seven. Over Ishikawa. Strawberry, Five, this time there's a bit of top spin on it. Every being the other side with underspin. First strawberry I can recall in this match. Clever idea right down the line, the parallel shot, the third one doesn't go in for Ito. She's back, the back end 40 on this serve. Takes it with the receive way out wide. And now two serves of her own. Let's see what she pulls out. She has a high toss kicking serve that goes to the backhand side. Side. There's another one she does where the ball actually breaks the other way. This match, it's a little bit slower serve, maybe more risky. to stop things here. Watch her racket and play with her spare. Part of the table, too. You know, Mimi Ito and Kina Hayata. Find another player. If you're playing Matilda Ekholm, she'll hit that ball around the net. Three. Matches where Mew Hirano beat three of the top three in the point was one of the key ingredients. Oh, 
her come back around this last game. This line, Ita won't have such a good opportunity, but she doesn't move in quickly. Opening spin shot. He's never been able to do before. And a serve into the net. The champion is 16-year-old Mila Ito.